Exciting news, you can now share brands in Adobe Spark. Stick around and I'll show you how. Hey everybody, what's going on? Claudio here and welcome to my channel where I share tips, tools, and tricks to help you share your story. Exciting news and update has come to Adobe Spark. Brands pretty much have been available now for some time, but now with those brands, you can invite others to brands within Adobe Spark. This is great. So if you have a team that are working on a project within your business, maybe you have clients and you created the branding for them, you can invite them to that branding content, which includes fonts, colors, and logos. So without any further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and jump in and show you how you can invite others. I went ahead and launched Adobe Spark on the web and I'm going to click on brands here and show you that I've got multiple brands. I've got my main personal business brand, I've got some generic, some demo ones, and I've got one for my day job. And all these here I'm able to do within the premium account. So if you have Creative Cloud, you're able to create multiple accounts. If you do not have the premium one, you'll have to upgrade in order to create multiple ones and as well to accept the invited ones. So the one I'm going to invite my colleague, which is going to be my other account that I have here is I'm going to use this Buckaroo Ranch. Now I can click here where it says invite right down here, or I can click on the three dots up there and do invite as well. So I'm going to click here and here I'll have a window where I can invite, I would say myself with my personal one there, which is this Gmail one. And then you can give a message to those that are going to be using this brand or collaborating with this brand. So here we go. Uh, this is the branding for Buckaroo. I think I just misspelled that Buckaroo Ranch. And there's really no Buckaroo Ranch. I just made that up. So click here where it says invite to view. And now down at the bottom says that Clyde Z Jr at Gmail has been invited to Buckaroo Ranch. So now I'm going to go to the other account, log in with that separate account and show you how to open that up. In the other account, you'll be able to see several places where you've been invited to a project. The first one is up here at the top right corner next to your avatar. You'll see a bell, a notification that says here, you have been invited to use the Buckaroo Ranch brand. So I'm going to go ahead and click accept so that I will have access to that brand. And now when I go to brands over here, there's going to be my brand here. And then if I click on shared with you, I'll have access to these brands. So whenever I work on a project, create something, what I'll do here, let's go ahead and just really quick kind of create a sample one. Let's do that there. And I can go ahead and bring in the brand into this project. So if I go here and let's see, let's go ahead and close this up right here click on logos and there they are the brands I can bring in. So what I'll do now is click here and bring in that branding content here to this project, add it as a watermark or whatever I want to use with that brand. As I mentioned earlier, this is a great way to collaborate on a project within a team or share them with clients that you have. Not only will the branding be available within Adobe Spark Post, but it'll also be viewable in Adobe Spark page, and it will also be available within Adobe Spark video. And that's how easy it is to share branding within Adobe Spark. If you have any comments or questions about this video, please do leave it in the comment section below. Don't forget, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and then click on the little bell to be notified for future videos. Thank you so much for watching this video and as always be good to one another. Peace. I'm out.